Welcome back. Today I'd like to talk about a transition I call sparsity to density. But before I get there, just uh, a couple of things. I'm showing you transitions because as I mentioned in the first episode, the important thing is to just practice transitions. Uh, and as you know, this is all geared toward live performance, but it of course can be used in the studio. Uh, they're compositional techniques, so whether you're live or mapping things out, um, I hope these transitions uh, give you some food for thought. Um, I'm, you know, making up the titles, like yesterday was blurry to crispy. Uh, I'm trying to keep the titles general so that I'm expecting and hoping you will take the general idea and apply it to your voice, to your musical styles. Um, and I'm just making up little specific uh, demos just as one of 10,000 possibilities in each of these transitions. So sparsity to density. Sparsity comes from Latin to me and means to scatter. So uh, I'm going to begin by scattering some notes, leaving a lot of space in between. I will loop that. I'm not going to make it a really long loop. Of course, this could go on you know, you could create a whole piece this way, like minutes. Um, and then as it loops back, I will start to fill in the gaps, making it more dense or, from the Latin, thicker. And eventually it will be very thick and we will have transitioned from sparsity to density. Okay, hope that makes sense and uh, enjoy the ride. Thanks for watching.
There you go. Have fun.